Hello everyone, this is Whitehawk and today we will be playing a new chapter in the Minty Fresh Adventure series. This game right here, I believe the name is Fresh Minty Adventure. And unsurprisingly enough, it's going to star a pony named Minty. Minty Fresh Adventure 2, I actually played a demo of that game a while ago, but it's it's a really big game, so it's taking a long time for the creator to like finish it. But not it, even though it's probably taking a long time for him to finish it, he still has plenty of time to do like other bunch of games uh, in the meantime. Although this is large because he reuses a bunch of assets for them. Even so, that the the engine of the Minty Fresh Adventure series is a uh, it's very solid, so it's very fun. Also, uh, this was just re-released like today so it's probably a bit rough around the edges. Minty, uh, she was in the uh, Minty Fresh Adventure, the very first game, but I never showed her in my video of it. I probably should I probably should actually redo my Minty Fresh Adventure like video because I missed a few things. One, one thing I, I purposely avoided but showing Minty where she was, uh, I never showed that. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Controls, arrow keys to move, ZC to jump, X to attack. Shift to dismount. Dismount? Dismount what? Probably something. But yeah, reused resources, so... Of course, uh, Minty is different from uh, Colgate, so... Hmm. Is, she is she throwing candy? That, that seems to be the case. Or, or mints! <laughs> yeah, that, that's right. She's throwing mints. Figures. And... She doesn't control as well as Colgate. Large, or actually, no, the Timberwolves, they're always annoying to deal against. And I, I just remember that... Uh, you can't really, uh, like, kill the Timberwolves by simply jumping on them. And wait, that Timberwolf actually eats my mints? Better ignore it then. Oh, space is to pause, and X is to... Yeah. Oh my goodness, I have to go all the way west to heal myself? Maybe I was supposed to actually visit Zakora as soon as I like started the game. Probably. Is he friendly with me now? He is. Okay, okay, so if I feed the uh, owlbears or whatever, they actually become friendly with me. That, that's kind of nifty. Okay, okay. Still can't run, though. Anyway, Zakura, can you help me? Oh, I bet she's gone. To those who come to seek my aid, I'm sorry it must be delayed. I'm out to find herbs for my brew. I shall be back by half past two. But if you can't wait and you're brave, find me in the eastern cave. Ugh. Oh, no voice acting, because, uh, again, reused assets, and the uh, game creator probably was, like, doing this in his spare time. Like, because he was bored with the main game and how long it's taken to, for him to finish him, for, to finish it. Also, for some reason, it re-healed my character anyway. Uh, I guess Minty, like, entered uh, Zakora's house and just, like, took care of uh, re-healing herself anyway. Whoa. To stay away. Halt, citizen! This area is under investigation by the Canterlot Royal Guard. No visitors allowed. I saw you looking. Why is it that the Royal Guard uh, took control of uh, Trixie's blimp anyway? Like, was, was she doing illegal business or something? Probably. It is Trixie. And despite what many fans may believe, she is an antagonist. No amount of fanfic writing will change that. And you guys see the uh, Minty's shadow at the bottom there? That that's kind of a error right there. But I, again, this is this was done with reused assets and the guy's spare time while he's working on a much bigger project. So not expecting much. Also, I'm getting murdered right now. Okay, can, can I jump on this? No, I cannot. Oh, but I can jump on them, and yeah, now I'm safe, or safer. Get away and enter the eastern cave. Hopefully, uh, I'll probably get a checkpoint actually. 
checkpoint right here. Can I, can I feed the cockroaches? Yes, I can, but... Okay, you have to feed enemies several, uh, like a, a, a certain amount of time. Whoa. It, the cockroaches is with me now? Okay. Can I, can I... Oh, I can send a... I can send it towards enemies to, to petrify them. Does it work on skeletons? Yes, it does. And I can use the skeleton as a platform. Okay, I, did, I see the new gameplay element uh, that was incorporated right here. Hmm. That, that's really nifty. Uh, can I check the controls, actually? No, I cannot. I, I probably should have paid more attention to the controls. Because, uh, whoa, what the hell? How did that work? I guess you have to hit them a few times. Let me give me that sock. Hmm. Seems Minty does have a voice, but not not for like uh, dialogue during scenes. Oh, there's a Cora. What happens if I try to petrify her? Nothing. You can't petrify the Cora, unfortunately. She's too smart for that. Hey, it's a Cora. What's up? <laughs> okay. Why, Minty? What a nice surprise! I hardly could believe my eyes. You were in prison for a year. Why ever would you come back here? Oh, I lost my socks. But hey, is it just me? Or has inside of this cave, like, moved around since last time? What's up with that? Mm, I, I don't think I have the Minty's accent right. Oh well. The Cave of Wisdom is a creature of chaos. It takes many forms. And you didn't rhyme, Zakora. Ah, uh, how I wish that were true. But sadly, that was a high cue. <laughs> well played there. Well played, Zakora. Uh, okay, uh, Zakora is probably gonna be like for. She's probably gonna be help for some time else uh, when I check out uh, the cave more. Oh, I, and I can I can double jump with the cockatrice. Okay, okay, th this is really really cool. I really like my pet cockatrice right here. Can I get these uh? Thanes as uh, pets too? No, actually, uh, the mints killed them before. Uh, I suppose if I get hit, I might lose my cockatrice. Probably. I'm still a bit miffed. I, I don't know if uh, I can run or not, but uh, I always felt the walking speed of the Minty Fresh Adventure series was a bit slow. Not, not in the original like uh, demos of Pony, Pony Platforming Project. Th those are fine in speed, and also an actual checkpoint right here. But when it got into a Minty Fresh Adventure, it, just, it seemed it got a lot slower for some reason. Or rather, the run feature was removed and, uh, yeah. Hmm, and this happens after Minty Fresh Adventure 1. It's, it's basically DLC for Minty Fresh Adventure 1. It's, it's even said in, like, the description. Ow. Okay, so I keep my cockatrice even if I get hit. That, that's very nice to know. I don't know where I'm going, by the way. Uh, I, I think I'm supposed to do something with the blimp outside, but uh, I don't know what. Also, another sock right there. I suppose what I'm doing really is getting socks right now. And another checkpoint. Can I teleport between them? Also, okay, that's what this mountain is for. Petrification doesn't actually uh, kill me. Okay, back with this pet. Hmm. Was I able to actually get the uh, owl bears as a pet? That that, that would have been nifty. I think I think I like the cockatrice the best though. Can I can I jump on this thing? Okay, this this is strange. I was I imagine I would have been able to jump on this thing, but I can't. And now it's stuck there forever. Oh well. Oh, maybe I can reach the socks from here. Ah, oh, I almost had it. And I just dismounted my uh, cockatrice. So now I have to find another one. Can I, actually, can I get those stains as pets? Yep. So basically, this is a pet system. And wow. Okay, so you can move fast with these things. But you can't double jump, unfortunately. And then you can throw fireballs as well. 
I, I don't believe, since I don't know where everything is in this, uh, like, new game, I'm not going to try to get everything, but, I, well, I am trying to get everything, I just, I probably won't, because it's my first time playing this. It's basically a first impressions playthrough. Hmm. Can I get this? No, I cannot. And it's all because I can't double jump. And the boss is down there. I suppose I'm going to have to go down there. Unless uh, Minty's already defeated him. Probably. Let's go down there. Well, this is different. And what happened to my pet? Oh, no, it's actually still there. Okay. It's a spider of some kind. Socks. Yeah, it is a spider. Uh, kind of humanoidish spider. Well, uh, here's a name for this. Uh, Narachnoid. Also, that thing has a lot of socks. And it's actually surprisingly difficult to fight. But I, I, I think I can walk under it. And yeah, when it when it like crouches, I probably get hit if I try to hit it. But uh, okay, so the, the hitboxes of this thing is are really weird. And sometimes it jumps. And yeah, yeah. So well, I beat it on my first try, but kind of a lot of luck. Wait, is is this already it? Well, it's it for like the main game, but I'm guessing there's like a uh, there's lots of secrets I never I, I completely missed, Impr including probably like different endings. Yeah, likely. But you know what? I, I if this is the ending, I guess I'll keep this video short. Yeah, I probably still wasn't happy. Hmm. Bad end, I suppose. Wow, th this this is the first time we've seen Applejack and the rest of the main six in the Mitty Treasure Adventure series or Pony Platform Main Project series. Like, only Applejack appeared in the first two games, and after that, Applejack got, like, uh, sidetracked by, uh, Colgate. And now Minty's back. She was from G3. If I... I think? I think so. And Applejack is back, too, but... Yeah, just as a... for, like, one image. You know... For something that uh, the creator did in his spare time, this ending sure is long. But it's a cute ending, I'll, I'll give him that. And yeah, that, that's it. That's Wind Waker-ish ending right here, but... As soon as you get to beat the boss, uh, you're already like uh, done with this uh, spare game. This game that was done on his spare time. But I'm sure I've missed out a lot of secrets. Like, Zikora probably had something you could do more. And I saw that Trixie model right there that you could probably do something with. And, of course, there's a royal guard who was guarding Trixie's blimp at the beginning. There's probably, you can do, there's probably something you can do with that as well. And there's the pet system that I really didn't, like, uh, use uh, as much as I could have. Uh, I think I could, like, have used the uh, bugbears. And... Hmm, who else could I have used as pets, actually? Actually, you know what? Maybe I could have, like... Maybe I could have used the uh, mints on the spider. And I could have, like, befriended it. Maybe. Anyway, I got end in one, and... Yeah, I missed out on a lot of things. Well, I beat the game without dying once on my very first try. At least, uh... I got that, and also we can check out the other uh, PD Mark reports right here. Ask Mr. Albear. Medusa's apprentice. <laughs> Good to get it. You have to be kind of a jerk to everyone. <coughs> hmm. 
You are doing it wrong. Yep, lots of secrets in this game. Despite the fact it's a game that was done in the spare time as a DLC for Mythic Fish Adventure, sort of, kinda. And that's it! Okay, okay, I'll put the link in the description if you guys want to try it out, and I might do a video in the future about this game when I, like, found everything, and I'll make a video where, like, 100% of the things found. That being said, it probably won't have, like, uh, my commentary with it, and I guess some of you guys might prefer that. But whatever. So anyway, I hope you've all enjoyed this video, and I hope you all have a very nice day. Bye-bye!